Hello Pisces, hope you're doing well. Barlow is here to uh, assist. Are you here to assist? Well, thank you. Um, I'm going to pull some cards on your current energy, see what's going on. Happy full moon, today is December 7th. Go make some moon water tonight. <laughs> um, this is for anyone with Pisces in their chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And it is general, so it may not resonate with everyone. All right, what does Pisces need to know right now for their highest good and only their highest good? This page of pentacles keeps coming out. Empress, what else we got? We got knight of swords, fast movement, could be fast growth. Um could be news around pregnancy. Maybe someone's pregnant. Seven of Cups keeps coming out for everybody too. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Queen of Cups. them on the floor. I'm not going to take this though. We have Sun, the Fool, Page of Wands. Well, What is the Empress? Maybe if I figure out what this growth is. Four of Wands, Hanged Man. Could be buying a house. It could be, this could just be signifying like, kind of like upgrading in your life, you know, kind of like taking those next steps. It could have a lot of options. Now, I don't know. Everyone is obviously at different pages of their life. So Seven of Cups can be options. And ultimately, these options make you happy and they help provide a new beginning. The only thing is you might have to take risks. But just be careful. I mean, with every risk, you should be careful. I think it's just a matter of... I want to say don't rush, but then we have the Knight of Swords here, which is kind of like that rushing energy. What can you tell me about the Knight of Swords? Why is the Knight of Swords here? Knight of Swords. What is this fast movement? Strength. Um, I immediately feel that you actually might be able to make these important decisions. 
more wisely now so you're capable of making decisions more quickly because I feel like you you've gained the knowledge and because of this strength that you have endured through this growth because empress can be you know major personal growth so you've been through something in your life that has helped you grow and learn to be able to make better decisions basically I mean, this could even be something that keeps coming back around in your life. And spirit is just saying, you know, you know better. Like, you know which path to take. Because it looks like some type of communication is coming in. Um, I think it's just a matter of... deciding what to do with that information. Again, it could be in regards to a house. It doesn't have to be, it can just be in regards to either your stability, it can be in regards to an event, maybe a wedding or a party of some sort. But there's, there's a change in perspective. So something must have happened, whether it's this communication that's coming in. It's very similar energy to Capricorn. It's like, you know, something, was it Capricorn or, Cap, or um, Aquarius? I don't remember now. Like, there's something that's being said which helps you choose which direction to go. But it looks good because we have sun, the sun here, Queen of Cups. This is an energy of feeling. Um, Marlo, what? Can I help you? Hi. You want to sit on my lap? Come on. You gotta let go. Or, or not. Okay, sorry. He keeps like patting me on my leg. <laughs> Pisces. I think there's 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 definitely a change coming in. And I think you're well equipped to make the right choice this time around. If it's something that's coming back around again. If not, I think you just have enough knowledge, enough experience to make the right choice. All right, I'm repeating myself. That is your reading, Pisces. I hope this brought some guidance and clarity for you. And I'll see you in the next one. Love you.